For God so loved the world, He gave His only begotten Son. That whoever believes in Him shall not perish, but have everlasting life. His name is Jesus. Last night I felt like I missed the rapture again. Uh, I woke up with uh, a sense of urgency. Uh, overwhelmed feeling. The people were missing. The joy of God uh, comes from knowing that the uh, covenant is sealed by what Jesus Christ did on the cross for you, accepting you as your Lord and Savior, knowing you're going to go home soon with Him as the bride of Christ. The love that uh, I've been shown um, from Jesus and the Father has far surpassed uh, anything here on this planet. Uh, the love of God really pours out on an individual, transforming their life uh, on a million of acceptance that you're His. You are metamorphosed into uh, a brand new person, a being uh, uh, the joy of God pours out more abundantly in a obedient life, walking in love versus being angry, vexed, and bitter. Malice towards others, rather just forgiving and moving on. Everything's in God's hands. And He will always move on your behalf because you're His child. He will honor His word when He gives you. And you will see it manifest before your eyes 100% unstipulated because He loves you. He just wants to bless you. Jesus is Lord. Hallelujah. Glory to God's promises are forever. Hallelujah. Glory to the King. His hand is upon your children. His promises are real. It's not about getting even, being the best Christian. All the fallacies of self-centered spiritual warfare are garbage. It's never against another Christian. There's the righteous to stand before God, and there's the wicked.
rebuke Monica Soto in Jesus' name. I rebuke all who attack me and my children in Jesus' name. I rebuke the gang members of Lindsay, California, plotting to hurt innocent people in Jesus' name. There's more power and authority in the name of Jesus Christ. There's all authority under heaven. I rebuke the witch Maria Cepeda in Jesus' name.